To write the formula for chromium-3 chloride, we go to the periodic table, we look up chromium and we see the element symbol for chromium, that's Cr, and then chloride, we're looking for the chlorine, that's Cl. Chromium, that's a metal, and then chlorine, that's a nonmetal. So metal and a nonmetal, that gives us an ionic compound. We have to consider the charges on the chromium and the chloride when we write the formula for chromium-3 chloride. Chromium, it tells us right here, this Roman numeral 3, that's a 3 plus ionic charge. Chromium is a transition metal, so we have the Roman numerals here, and they tell us the charge. Chlorine on the periodic table, 1 minus. So these don't add up to 0, but we can change the subscripts here to make that happen. So we use something called the crisscross method. We move the 1 here and the 3 over here. We don't write the 1, get rid of this, and that's the formula for chromium 3 chloride. Let's check our work quickly, make sure we got it right. We said chromium, because of the Roman numeral, was a 3 plus. Chlorine, we looked up on the periodic table, that was a 1 minus. So I have three of these chlorines, each one's a 1 minus. 3 times 1 minus, that's 3 minus. 1, the chromiums, 1 times 3 plus, that's 3 plus. So 3 plus, 3 minus, net charge is 0. This is the correct formula for chromium 3 chloride. Let's clean this up. And that's it, chromium-3 chloride, CrCl3. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.